Hey guys, Metal Soulstorm here, welcoming you back to some more Sudeki, and last time, uh, we reached the Crystal Reef, which like, looks exactly like Brighton, except a lot more funky and messed up. And there, the sky is all dark, and you know, there's lightning and storming all around, so it's not exactly a good place. We went to basically what they thought was a mirror world, so last time we left off, we helped, uh, we proved ourselves to the Reverend, I gave him, uh, a holy symbol of Tetsu, and we're going to continue. We got some information from the boy that we need to use uh, the elevator to get down to deal with the siren that is around here. So we're going to go do that. We're going to go talk to the mayor and start getting this stuff out of the way. And, start, and just kind of keep continuing the main quest here. So back up here, back and talk to the mayor again. Ooh, my sound here is a little loud, so I'm going to turn it down to just a tad. Alright, anything new from the wife? Where are all my children? Huh. Alright. So Kerfin thinks the entrance is at the bottom of the cliff, does he? I'll switch on the elevator for you then. Good luck. It is with that hairstyle. <laughs> Alright. Oh. We have access to the elevator now. Sweet. Oh. Quick check down. After this, like really, uh, <laughs> a long, uh, <laughs> a long cutscene that we didn't really need there, but whatever. All right. All right. We're inside. All right, let's look. Have us a look around. Let's see what we can find. Lots of broken stuff. A very kind of yellowish green. This area. So. Come into this room. This place is amazing. Look at it. These drawings are strange. They're of some sort of mermaid. <laughs> this one looks pretty good to me. <laughs> <laughs> really, Tell? Oh my, she's a beauty, all right. Very bountiful, so to speak. <laughs> it's said that a man's feeble heart would melt the moment she began to sing. I could see why. She's obviously a healthy specimen. <laughs> and of course, uh, half naked. <laughs> of course. I can't see what's so fascinating about a half naked fishwoman singing sea shanties to any man that comes along. I'm sure it's not so interesting when all you can smell is wet fish in your lap. Ooh. Don't spoil the image. <laughs> Men are like fish. Easy to catch, briefly satisfying. And then just a bag of bones that stinks up the tent. <laughs> oh, stop it, you. We're offended now, aren't we, Tal? <laughs> Alright. Uh, so, I think we can actually check the mural. No. But yeah. But. The yeah, between three and these days are said to have perished upon hearing the song. So yeah, there you go. So there's the back end, there's tail, tits, hair, all that good stuff. Uh, and we got a big ass fish, it looks like here. Check. Carver's a long dead sea creature. Whatever it did, this must have been a formidable foe. Alright, so we're gonna have to be careful. Alright, we'll continue along here. <coughs> Oop, a little loop de loop back here. Grab all these crates, see if we can collect any extra healing items. Nothing on that one. Bugger. For some reason, Bookie was still back there. So. That cutscene. The 
This place is something special, isn't it? It has a certain atmosphere. Can you hear that? It's beautiful. Uh, it gets inside your head, doesn't it? Are you two still discussing the finer points of aquatic ladies? I can hear it. So clear. I hear you. Sing. Sing to me. What? Most beloved siren. I am coming. She knows me. Uh... <laughs> Where are you going? All right. Well, Tell and Alcohol got lured. I also have to be careful with these guys because they have health regeneration. That's what makes them really annoying. But with the upgrades I did to Buki, it shouldn't be too much of a problem. I think actually there may be a quest to collect these guys' corals. I can't remember. But I'll just collect a bunch just in case if there is. Well, as you can see, though, Buki is critting quite often, though, now. So. Getting the best weapons and then putting the upgrades I did really helps out. Like I said, I could make it better just by, uh. If I just increase the crit, but I think it would just be a waste. Because you definitely need the health steal, and you definitely the damage up helps too. First direction I need to take here is what I'm trying to remember. So this is sealed off. It's locked. Uh, just do a quick loop and make sure I didn't forget any chest or whatnot. That's where we came from. That's where Tal and Elko got lured to. Hmm. Yeah, I think it's just a way up. Well, there's, something, there's something here up here. Is this just another way up, I'm guessing? Maybe? There's a way that way, but I don't think I can go this way yet. No. That's not open, so I can't go that way. There's a save. I'm not going to use it because it's more like 8 minutes in, so... No point in doing that. And of course, you know, Ailish and Buki are unaffected being, you know, female, so... They're unaffected by the siren's call. But yeah, just a, another way to get up. So let's check this out. Looks like something has to be placed in the pillars by the statue. Traditionally, seafaring men used to offer mermaid pearls to mermaids who had won their hearts. Alright, so the door opened up back here, so let's go over there. Alright, I'll probably continue to, continue to play as Buki. I'm trying to remember where the hell is it down below? Uh, yeah, it looks like it. Looks like Alright, so, gotta grab to get some uh, sea pearls, it seems like, to, to pour something to put in place there, so. Probably gonna get attacked again. No. All right, let's go here. If I remember correctly. All right. Deal with these guys. Get them out of here. 
Oh yeah, crowns. This is why this place is a bit of an issue. Because like I said, they do hit very hard. But the Hell Steel does help. Oh great. This is annoying. Oh yeah, I forgot. They also drain your uh They also drain your SP, which is annoying. You can't resist my healing kiss. You see, I'm getting my SP back by shooting this guy, so. That way, I can abuse the hell out of Ailish's uh, abilities. The thing I need to do now though is to really boost her uh, her essence. There we go, back to shooting speed. As you can see her SP is not coming back a lot faster now. Uh, let's just do performance. I think you guys have seen this one yet. I'll chill your flesh and break your frozen heart. Buki's all jacked up, but she should be fine as long as, as long as I keep playing as Ailish and healing her, she'll be fine. Like I said, this is the this is the reason why you get the ultimate weapons. Those the guys here do hit like a truck, so having the health steal and the best weapons is gonna certainly help. Um, let's go bottom first and then go up. Just trying to remember. What I don't think it doesn't matter which. Uh, way you go because you have to go all these ways eventually. Ooh, we see some stuff over there. More skulls. Now we got the snake guys again. So, the thing we're gonna do is we're gonna Cast uh, wind on her, but like I said, once you get the uh, ability to steal, you get your SP back through every hit. You can it really kind of breaks the game a little bit for for especially for Ailish because you can just keep pouring in stuff, or keep uh, your SP up, and just keep pouring out the magic abilities. So my next rule, my next thing plan is to. Uh, uh, get her essence up so that it just starts doing massive damage to her abilities. I like where this guy first though. He's gonna be. Let's uh, do a fireball. Hello. I hate how they can just walk and all the damage that just annoys the hell out of me so much. Get back, or I'll so I'm hoping you guys see like why the health steal and the, the SP steal on weapons is so important for your melee you guys and your magic users. Especially melee because they're always interested. Using magic users you can stay away from the fighting but... Alright, so we did this. Let's uh. Oh, doesn't like a reveal there. What's this? Guards of a dead secret. Whoever killed it must have been a mighty foe. Yeah. It's like, oh, there's nothing to do. Oh, right here. Oh, I gotta get closer. So. Jeez. 
here. Ailish. Go over here. And then we grab Buki. Climb up. Alright. Uh, yeah, you can zoom in, in and out, but I like usually zoom out. There you hit the button here. And it'll open up another platform for us to get to that treasure chest. So. Alright, once it gets back. Get back down. And we'll go over and grab it. I believe, if I recall correctly. It should be an actual key item we need to continue on in this area. Let's uh, grab this. Shell key, yep. Just an item we need, so continue on. Like I said, now I'm not too worried if I miss any chests in the area since I got the ultimate weapons, because that's the main reason why I like to get all the chests, get all the quests out of the way. But now I'm not too worried about it now. Mostly now it's just going to get orbs or, you know, just flooring or money or currency or whatever. So, no, I'm not too worried about it. Like I said, if I could see the chests, I'll, I'll grab them. But, not too worried about it. Anyway, I'm going to continue playing as Alish and keep uh, breaking her game breaking abilities. Like I said, next thing I need to do is I need to uh, pump up her essence a lot. Alright, not that. Ugh, that's annoying. Alright. Alright, I can do the counteract that. Cast wind. One step ahead. Oh, ass shot. <laughs> that camera pan. Alright. Oh, let's. Nice. We'll do this right here. This should hit. Hopefully, it'll hit at least three. Like I said, it's, it's, those upgrades really, really help. Like I said, if I didn't have those weapons or these upgrades, this, this little area is a real big pain in the ass. It really is. Collect shell. I mean, you can see the damage I'm taking. Like, 500 damage. Buki was taking 500 damage from the, 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 the crabs. So it's like, ugh. Not flooring. Alright, that's... I mean, I'm not gonna complain, but uh, can't go this way, so gotta go this way. Oh, yeah, go over here, grab all this stuff first. Star miles, more miles, stuff I already have full on. This is the one thing I did notice though, this game has weird limits on certain things. Like some things can only get 5, some things you can only hold 10, and other things you can only hold 15 of. Like the more power of stuff you can only hold very few, so. Which does suck, but uh, I guess it's to try to balance it up. But once, like I said, once you get the enchants on these weapons, they kind of become fucking moot at this point. Alright, open. I just can't wait to play as a local with the the three damage upgrades I put on the uh, iron pistol or the iron blaster or whatever. That's gonna be crazy. All right, so let's first browse. Oh yeah, this, I forgot about this part. The song hit. 
part of this long part. Okay, I got the play that again on my my sound was turned down too low so you have to play a song so I'm just gonna remember AFG yeah I'll just cheat because I do have a pen by me so let's see here so Ugh. So A F G A F uh. Alright there we go. A F G, G minor major which are in D. Wasn't there a fifth one? I think it was E, wasn't it? E, okay yeah. I haven't played music my piano or guitar in a while, so I can't remember the chords all that well anymore. I think it's no, I think it's G major. I think A D F. Okay, so it, it was D F E G. Okay, so I got it. There we go. Not the most intuitive thing, but... Alright. I believe it will remove the barrier, so it allows us to grab this pearl first. There we go. I already have. Okay. Got it. Alright. That was the pearl. So next stop. Yeah, this is the upper part of the middle area as you can see. So that's where we're at right now. Alright, let's head them on down and go through the other door. Ugh, hiccups. Ugh. I'm trying to remember where I don't think it went this way. Did I? do because there's a save thing here but I'm not gonna hit it all right ah the other part all right so we gotta get across so basically it's a switch puzzle basically and there is where we need to go But there's a trick. We can't go in pairs. We have to do this thing separately. So, Buki has to get up here. Alright. First hit. Break this. Just collect all the stuff you can. Might as well. Ryan, don't have any like that. What's over here? Is it chest? Oh no, it's just a more. Okay, yeah. Alright, so I'll hit the switch first and help get Elish across. Alright, where was that switch? Should be just over here in it. Yeah. I think this is the reset button. I think that's what this is. It resets everything. Maybe. So I'm gonna hit that, but that's not what I need to hit, though. All right. Hit this switch. So 
Ayla should be able to get across now. Yep. So, we'll walk across with her. I believe you do not get attacked in this area, so... I'm trying to remember... Uh, I think I have to hit this, which I think... Then we can have access to the chest in the other area. Switch back to Ailish. And we'll just get along here. Let's quickly grab the uh, chest here. It's a fancy chest, so it's probably a weapon or an orb inside. And it's an orb, okay. And there's nothing else, so I think the last thing I need to hit is this. Alright. Cross. Hit this. I'll switch back to Pookie in a sec here, so we see. Yeah, there's no other switch, so I believe that's what we have to do. So, hit the switch again. And I should raise the other one. Yes, there we go. That's a boot. Technically, you can just climb back down and walk across, but, well. No. They, they put a shortcut here, so I might as well just use it. Anyway, so, get across here. And we're meet, meet back up with Ailish here. Come on, Ailish. Alright. Keep pressing the one instead of F1. There we go. Yuck. Well, looks putrid. Alright. So, so we got the other one. So we can leave this place now. And I'll stick to playing with Ailish, like I said. It'll, it'll be much easier to run through this place as Ailish so I can heal Buki up when I run into. I mean, Buki does have the hell steal, but even still, sometimes I might just get a, a bit of ba uh, bad luck and I might get messed up. So, uh, look at the time. We're at almost at the 30 minute mark, so I'm going to call it here. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, comment down below, and I hope to see you around. So, later.